day 225 of me doing my New Year's resolution, which is dropping a video every single day on this channel, all the way up until December 31st, 2024, all the way up until the last day of this year. Now today is August the 13th. This is video 225. That means we're on track. And don't mind the footage, man. Y'all can watch the game play. These two trash-ass niggas playing 1v1 against each other. They both suck. I'm sorry. You know what I'm saying? They both are terrible. Y'all can watch the footage. But you can watch them. You know, I just put the footage there so y'all can kind of have something to look at while I make this video. But that's besides the point, man. Topic of this video. For some reason, bro, like, I, I, I feel like I made a video like this before, but I have to make an updated one, man. Like, anytime I'm... Not trying to get women, that's when the women come, bro. You got to understand that. That That's what I have to understand too myself, man. Because I ain't going to lie. Before I was a try hard, man. Before I would try to go out, shoot my shot. Before I would try to, you know what I'm saying, make it to where, you know, I I, you know, I, I put myself in situations to where, you know what I'm saying, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to gain some sort of validation from the woman. You know what I'm saying? Maybe I take her on a nice date. Make it seem like I'm a really great guy make it seem like you know what i'm saying i'm that you know i'm that nigga you know what i'm saying but that I, for some odd reason when i was doing shit like that i always you know what i'm saying i didn't really get what i wanted out of the woman you know what i'm saying I don't, for some odd reason it's weird but as soon as a nigga stop focusing on them as soon as i stop making them my objective y'all know my objectives changed this year i have a whole different objective women is not on that list and now the fact that women's not on that list i feel like they just fall in my lap you get what I'm saying? Like, I'm a different girls got different crushes on me. Like, I'm hearing, like, I'm at my workspace. You know what I'm saying? I never deal with, I, okay, that's a whole different video. But never fuck with your coworkers. I'm going to tell y'all that right now. That's a whole different video. But I got some of my coworkers, they crushing over me. And I'm, I'm that type of nigga, like, I just do my job type shit. They, they not a part of my objective. I'm not even trying to smash. But now all of a sudden, like, they, they, they on a nigga dick. It's weird. Man, I don't understand it. It's like when I'm really like shift my focus away from the women, that's when the women try to gain my focus back. They try to, they try to, you know, it's like they know I'm not focused on them and they trying to, you know what I'm saying, gain my attention and it's not going to work. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm very, I'm very, very, you know what I'm saying? I'm very, very locked in for the most part, especially from women. You know what I'm saying? The only thing that's really been getting me is be, being more social around, you know, friends and, you know, hanging out with my friends more. That's really been stirring me off the wrong. Women ain't been a problem for me. You know what I'm saying? I, I, that's not a part of my objective. That's not a part of my list. I don't get distracted by that. You know, maybe I had my phases here and there on this journey. But as of right now, I've been I've been doing a good job not letting them, you know what I'm saying, take any of my attention away. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm locked in on the prize. And, and they don't, they, shit, they know where near what I'm trying to get. They know where near, you know what I'm saying, what I'm trying to achieve on this journey. So I just push them to the side for now. You know what I'm saying? I'm sacrificing the women right now. You know what I'm saying? That's a big sacrifice to make. As a man, it's to sacrifice the women. And if you can actually do that, I ain't gonna lie, you be you gonna be you gonna get far in life because a lot of guys they can't fathom sacrificing women. Oh, sacrificing what the fuck? No pussy. What? You're crazy. Like, bro, you gotta understand, bro. Sometimes you gotta do things that's hard in order to get the things that you want. Sacrificing the pussy, sacrificing the women, that's just hard, bro. It's not easy. Every single not every night, but sometimes I go to sleep, I'll be like, damn, I can use a bit, I can use some I can use some ass right now. But you know what I'm saying? I always know, you know, that that, that ass is only 10. I, I, that shit ain't going to do shit for me. It might feel good, but it ain't going to do shit for me. I want to just keep this energy and just and just keep making it flow other places other than, you know what I'm saying, instant gratification. And that's been working for me. But like I was saying, bro, it's like the women, they just... They just, they just there. Like when I'm not, when I'm not trying to get with them, when I'm not trying to, you know what I'm saying, shoot my shot, when I'm not trying to do nothing crazy, when I'm not trying to even go out on a date, these motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying, they just on a nigga dick, like on some weird shit. It's crazy how it works like that. But you gotta understand, bro. As a man, once you really shift your focus and you and you and you and you just lock in on what you need to lock in on, and when you're focused on what you need to focus on. The women, they come with that. I hope you know that. They like a man that's 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 in on his goals. They like a man that's, you know what I'm saying, that, that that's ambitious, that's chasing his dreams. They love that. They ain't going to say that. They say that. They're going to say they like a guy that, that pay attention to them. But you, you can't listen to what they say. You got to listen to what they do. You get what I'm saying? And ever since I've been retaining, retaining my semen, bro, and, I, and ever since I've been 
focused on what I want to do and what I like to do in this life, my hobbies, my goals. The women, they've been coming, bro. I have not been short on that. Best believe I talk to women every single day, <laughs> every fucking day, even though I'm retaining my semen, I still some way, shape or form interact with a woman outside of, you know, what I'm saying outside the house every single day. You know what I'm saying? And hey, like I said, man, they, they I, I can tell when a woman like attracted. I'm not slow. Like I can tell when a woman's attracted to me when she's giving me, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, I can tell the small little thing. I pay attention. I observe, man. I'm a observe freak. You know what I'm saying? I just be observing the body language, man. Body language speaks louder than everything, man. I just I just watch the body language. You get what I'm saying? That's kind of how I can tell if a woman's, you know, into me or if, she, or if she's not into me. And if, I, you know, I'm having a conversation with a woman and, you know what I'm saying, I can tell she don't want to really talk anymore. Like, I, you know, I, I see the body. I can read that shit and I'll just stop talking. It's as simple as that. But ever since I've been retaining my semen, my conversations have been flawless. Not flawless. I'm just bullshitting. But they've been better than before. I'm able to, you know what I'm saying, make conversations last way longer. You get what I'm saying? Because I'm not, you know, at the end of the day, I'm not trying to escalate anything to get to anything. I don't have an objective in the conversation. At the end of the day, I'm just talking. And when you really just talking without expecting shit, that's when you have the best conversations. I'm telling y'all, bro. I'm telling y'all. And I ain't going to lie. Like, the women, they've been feeling the boy. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, it's August. I got to stay locked in. I got a few more months. You know what I'm saying? And, hey. January, I'm not going to lie to y'all, bro. Shit. I'll tell y'all what I'm going to do January when, when, in a different video. I'm going to end this video here. Um, I appreciate you guys for tuning in. You know what I'm saying? As you can see in the video, man, these niggas, they ain't even scoring. Like, they not even scoring. Like, they ass. You get what I'm saying? But uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow.